As a structural biologist, I can work out what a protein molecule looks like by measuring how a crystal of the protein scatters x-rays. When we did this in the 1990s, we used to record or measure the scattering pattern on a piece of photographic film as the crystal was rotated through a very small angle. Now, to see the pattern of scattering, you had to then take the photographic film into the darkroom and develop it. And to get a complete set of measurements, you had to take, typically, about 200 photographs. It was long, hard, smelly work. Today, things are a bit quicker. I was at the Diamond Synchrotron near Oxford this morning with a couple of students from my group, and we were recording measurements from crystals that they had grown using a new type of detector called the Pilatus. This is what happened. Just look at the rate of data collection there. We've done 40 images, 50, 60, 70, 80. What are we doing? 800? Yeah. Yeah. So, you happy with the way things are going? Yeah, I'm happy. <laughs> What about Owen over there? Are you happy? I'm delighted with it, with the way things are going, but I'm processing stuff and hopefully we'll get, we'll get a full data set. And these are the images, not bad at all. 0.2 degree oscillation. Is that updating, yeah? Yes. Oh yes it is. So not bad at all. So that was a complete data set of 800 images recorded in just over two and a half minutes. As the man said, not bad at all. <laughs>